over Captain Zack and Losers Octos, I guess. So we're getting into our second Losers quarterfinals match of every, the night. Every Sonic does seem to have a different play style. Oh, yeah. You talk and about Ken, you talk about 6WX, you talk about... I mean, Kenny. there's a reason why they all have a different color of the Chaos Emeralds, mm -hmm. because it all represents a style, their play style, I guess. It represents a family, too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they all stand together. Yeah, and I get... Oh, wow, Mr. E breaking out the cloud. Interesting, very interesting pick. Not confident in his Marth in this matchup, it seems, or unless maybe uh, just, just trying something out. Not sure. I have, no, I have never seen his, uh, his cloud before. So this would be very interesting. Yeah, I have not uh, seen this either, actually. Can't recall. But hey, uh, no, just another shorty. You can yeah. transfer his 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 tech skills spacing ability too. I think that it's a, it would be a, a quick pickup for Mr. E. Oh, in a lot of ways. In a lot of ways, very easy. So right. excited to see this. The thing I like about Cloud against Sonic is his large hitboxes really can just let him swat Sonic. Yeah, it's like swatting that pesky fly mm -hmm. that's moving around the the your room. Because right. Sonic. He is, uh, you hear those sound effects, and he's just zipping all over the, the stage. He's just going everywhere. He's going corner to corner, coast to coast. And Cloud, those meeting, like that nair, the back air, it just it kind of just stuffs that approach that Sonic is uh, kind of just trying to pester you with. Absolutely. So you just play a spacing game, play it safe. Uh, once you get limit, you have a lot of speed that you can work with as Cloud, so you're not too intimidated by Sonic's speed. You can kind of deal with it. So uh, I, do, I do think the pick is a good one. I'm interested to see Mr. E's Cloud in general, though. But that F-Smash, a little ambitious. Definitely. And 6WX opening up to a quick uh, percent lead. Because uh, you're going to see it like it's, it's a very different style of Sonic as compared to Manny, which we just saw. 6WX, he's very in your face. Um, so you're going to be seeing these uh, this, uh, more of aggressive style come out. And we got to see if Mr. E can, uh, I guess, make a comeback and adjust to that style. I and I guess he also comes to see it's like is is this cloud prepped enough for prepped enough for the Sonic? Well, what better place to have it than a weekly? Yeah, I mean the weeklies, especially for bigger tournaments, are the place to uh, showcase that character you have been working on for a little bit in the lab. Oh, that fastball though kind of sent him off the edge a little bit too much. Yeah, and that just looks like a little mischief by Mr. East part, and that can sometimes come from maybe just kind of get it together as cloud here, but we'll see. A little bit of a deficit here now. Manny, or I should say, excuse me, 6WX has a pretty decent lead, uh, lead to work with. And even though 6WX is quite the offensive uh, type with his Sonic, we could see him revert to more of a defensive type, but that doesn't seem to be the case at all. Exactly. I mean, like, when you've got this type of lead, you get to kind of, like, throw your, uh, your, I guess, your more predictable play style to the wind and kind of, like, be, play a little more laid back, I guess. You can throw out, you can throw out these uh, options because you're a lot more safer, I guess. Yeah. Oh, that limit! Not he did not. He shouldn't have burned it that early, but I mean he had to. Oh, the, the five knuckle shuffle sends him off, and we got a two stock game number one here from Six WX F Step Mr. E. He's got to make some adjustments. Maybe bring back out the Marth, maybe the Lucina. Kind of uh, just caught no man lands a few times, and, and when you see when you see the cloud, uh, you really look at you look at the off stage game. That's the first thing you, you really gauge. Yeah. Uh, with with somebody that's either a learning cloud. Um, getting the no cloud or using starting to use cloud a little more, so um, definitely didn't look very comfortable off stage at all. And uh, I think this uh, six damage really made him pay uh, for those situations. But Sonic can take apart, really uh, take apart cloud off stage very well. So uh, something that Mr. E just has to be very careful of, try to uh, not end up in those situations. Mm -hmm. yeah. And we're off to another vastly similar start to game one here. Uh, 6WX takes a quick and early percent lead, and it's uh, Mystery on kind of like backpedaling to try and get himself back into this game. Oh, he's burning that limit. Ooh. That just happened to work out. <laughs> yeah, like that was a real, that back there that we saw come out from 6WX just kind of like hit him right at the, I guess the best part to like force the limit burnout. But 6WX was not able to capitalize on the forced uh, limit Clint Hazard and ended up allowing uh, Mystery to get back on stage. But yeah. that spin, spin dash into uh, back air, gaining him that stage. Ooh, almost died up getting caught charging, though. Yeah, didn't have the invincibility because it wasn't released. So uh, that quick up tilt able to get him out of it. Yeah. All right, only 6% differential between these two. 6WX 
a little bit on the back foot, trying to figure out how he's going to close this stock off. Maybe one quick grab with a back throw is going to end it, but you know, that limit is going to make it a little yeah. more difficult. But that limit's going to set it up where that up air into spring uh, spring jump up air is going to kill even quicker. And I like what Mr. E was doing, where he was just using quick tilts. Just every time Six Davis wanted to come up and spend dash right behind him, he's just like, no. He just tilts. But uh, yeah, catching him up there in no man's land, no good. Definitely. Oh, no. Oh. oh. Good. He lived. I was not thinking he was going to live. You never <laughs> yeah, know with Huff down here because when you like go and contest him when he's like trying to drop down and you are uh, you're at high percent, you're like, oh my gosh, I'm probably going to die from this. Yeah, it'd be a silly way to lose a stock too if you didn't have to go up there and challenge him. Yeah. Uh, you know, is there pretty good. Oh, I like the mix up. It was a nice mix up, but it was just like you it, didn't really need to right, throw it out, I think. It, yeah, it seemed a little forced. Yeah. Really struggling to find his kill, getting a little desperate now yeah, as the percent's mounting. Oh, oh that's it. yeah. And we're seeing a 2 0 from 6WX looking real clean. Uh, six, I think Mr. E learned a lot from that set, though. Yeah. Uh, definitely going to be able to apply it 